I would now like to invite Shah Rukh to come on stage and to take this evening forward. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. Thank you very much for being here. And uh, <coughs> uh, thank you, Sanjay, for your kind words. And thank you, all the people who are part of the production. Wonderful to see you all. Of it's, it's like the same stage, so I feel like wanting to start presenting this show again. Aap sab ka swagat hai. Galat bol raho? Okay. Thank you very much. And, uh, you know, um, TED Talks India, nahi baat is uh, kind of like going back to school. The only difference being here that I have to sit on the front bench when I'm, I'm forced to sit on the front bench and look nice and attentive to everybody who's speaking and uh, expounding and talking about such wonderful ideas. Uh, because in school, I would find myself the back bench, sit down there quietly and hide myself from the teacher and quietly toast and chicken uh, inside my desk. <coughs> and um, the first thing uh, that, that actually, when I'm talking about growing up, is uh, we talk about dreams and every time everyone says uh, dream big and believe big and think big but more often than not dreams uh, were basically just a big part of our imagination a figment of our imagination nobody actually really believed that these dreams may come or turn into um, reality and what I noticed today um, or more than actually a year and a half back the first time when I met all the participants in TED Talks India nice Soch um, the first thing I realized is there's a whole set of new people, innovators, scientists, thinkers, young Indians here and abroad, who are not only just dreaming as part of a big imaginative process, but they really believe that it can be turned into reality. Lots of them came from very underprivileged backgrounds or uh, lack of entitlement, but what they were doing was not very selfish. It wasn't uh, you know, just to innovate and invent and become famous or rich. The idea was to bring about changes in lives of people who were perhaps a little better off than them in some, uh, in some cases. And that to me was very unselfish, uh, very motivated, and uh, extremely wanting to become part of TED Talks India. Nice soch then, and on to Naibat. And uh, of course, Uday Shankar paid me a lot of money, that helped. <coughs> that was nice, and Sanjay and Gaurav have been very, very kind. Uh, get opportunities to talk to an intelligent man like Chris Anderson here and abroad. And of course, uh, Juliet Blake, who's backstage, who keeps on correcting uh, my English pronunciation. So I know how to say audacious. I used to say audacious. So she keeps telling it's audacious, audacious. So my English is also improving. And of course, uh, I have my three murti here, Aradhna, Kausar, and um, uh, Sonia, and uh, Sahil who was directing, and all of them get angry if I don't take their names. So thank you very much. It's been really a wonderful journey. Uh, and, and so many other people who are involved with this. But to me, the main thing was that there is this young set of people, not sometimes, not so young, because I'm the youngest amongst all of them, as you know, I never grow old. But there were some um, younger people on and off on the show, uh, like just mentioned by Sanjay, 13-year-old Gitanjali, you know, at 13 years, She's figured out a way to figure out how much lead there is in the water that we drink at home through some app on a telephone. And at 13, I just used to sharpen pencils to take the lead out. That's the only thing I remember. Um, <coughs> there have been some really wonderful speakers. Uh, I can go on and on. There's uh, one lady called uh, Kavita Devi. I'm saying all the names right. I'm looking at my team, Kavita Devi, you know, who started this process. Herself illiterate, married at the age of 12 uh, from a small little village. And she figured out her life and started a newspaper called Khabar Leheria, uh, a whole movement where uh, you know, she was able to entice other women who were uneducated, who were underprivileged, um, from backward uh, classes and uh, even scheduled castes and scheduled tribes, got them to start uh, becoming part of this uh, innovative process to take news, uh, which is such a big thing nowadays and doesn't sound like news at all, but to take news and take it to the inner parts of the country and change the lives of these women and uh, you know, bring changes around in the villages and the towns that she's working in. And has, uh, there's this young man called Ankit who left his corporate job at 22 and decided, it's a simple logic, where there are a lot of weddings here. Food is waste, we waste in the house, we waste in 
हम लोग इतना सेलिब्रेट करते हैं ज़्यादा पकवान बन जाते हैं अमीरों के घर में अगर यही सारा खाना जो ख़राब हो रहा है उसको लेकर हम उनको पहुँचा दें जिनको खाना नहीं मिलता इज सच अ सिंपल थाट एंड यू हैड and before he knew it what surprised him most was that he has about 8 or 10000 workers who are called hunger heroes and who joined in as volunteers so amazingly innovative thoughts and uh, beautiful ideas and i i start feeling always that you know being an actor i want to first thank star for giving me this opportunity genuinely i even start designing my shirts with a star on them and i was uh, uh, so so touched by the fact that being an actor it's important for me to you know uh, sit hear listen feel understand where the younger india is going what's happening to the coming india and i don't want to be a sounding patronizing by saying kya hamara desh acche haathon mein hai of course acche haathon mein hai it's just that uh, perhaps people at my age and lot of you may not be able to comprehend uh, what young india feels what they want to say what they want to do and uh, it's really really wonderful uh, you know to get this opportunity so i want to thank star for giving me this opportunity also for converting this into five languages i sign extremely sex uh, sound extremely sexy in bengali i amit wa ke balu bashi david yeah it's really really cool i sound really nice yeah, yeah. even the kolangada temple is a very like a baby every time i have to say baby when i speak in a different language so the ladies understand but um, i really want to thank everyone for giving me this opportunity thank you all of all of you for being here and i think it's a family show we keep talking about in this times and times of otts where uh, everybody is uh, otting on um, stuff on ott i think uh, it's it's very very uh, you know it's it's uh, it's extremely important uh, that we watch things as a community at least at home and i think uh, this will make parents like me aware of what the younger new india is uh, heading towards and the younger ones uh, i think it will motivate them to understand that whenever they want to uh, earn well to become richer which i'm a big big uh, uh, promoter of they need to do well they need to earn money but somewhere if each business can touch and change the lives of people um, and if they can intend to use that for a purpose and make lots of money and become very famous and become whatever they wish to but somewhere touch and change lives of people through the work they do like most of the speakers and pe and presenters who've come on ted talks india nahi baat have done i think it will be a big motivational thing to them so it makes me extremely proud to have shared the stage with some of the real heroes of our new india so thank you star thank you all of you uh, thank you chris thank you juliet and yes speaking of juliet <coughs> i will use my best english to invite her on stage now because she is a huge big part of uh, making sure that ted india uh, ted um, ted talks india nai baat came to india came on television it was innovative new and uh, you know the reason that it would work and people would like it inshallah is because the speakers are hand picked chosen uh, worked upon uh, by juliet who really looks the whole year round does nothing else but finds these people to bring them on stage on uh, star and present it to everyone here in this country in all the languages that are that's been presented so thank you juliet please do come on stage and give us a perspective and all the other content that this year will hold a big round of applause for audacious juliet blake to be here i've spent so much time in mumbai like share and subscribe to tv next bollywood